Scene one, Apple, take one. Okay, it's kind of windy out here. Anywhere between three to six mile an hour wind. But I just couldn't resist testing this waterproof JJRC quadcopter. So what I did was I came down here, got some boots on and came down to the creek and give you guys a shot. I haven't flown this thing in the water yet, but the water seems pretty calm here. So, <laughs> without further ado, let's see what happens and uh, hey, take a look. Okay, first off, one thing I want to say about this thing, <laughs> this thing got some really cool rates on it. I haven't flown it, like, except for in the house, but you guys got to check these rates out, man. Okay, hang on. All right, now this is, uh, this is the, well, actually, it needs to be trimmed a little. It's kind of windy out here, but you know what? This thing is a lot of fun, so let's take that chance. All right, now this is the first yaw on the first rate. Let's bring her in. Like I said, it's kind of windy out here. All right, hang on. All right, now this is the first yaw. Not too much. Now, let's do the second one. There's three rates on here. First one was kind of crappy, but let's see if we get more control on the second one. And then blah, blah, blah. You know, you've seen it. One, you've seen one, you've seen them all, right? Wait till you see this. Check out the third. Let's see how it does in the wind with the third rate. Because at home, this thing was spinning like a UFO. Hang on. All right, I hope you heard the three beeps. Now look at that. Oh shit, look at that. Isn't that something? It actually just crashed in the water. So if anything's going to see if it's waterproof, it's going to be this here. Now that was a blooper. But you know what? They said it was waterproof. So why cut the tape? Okay, and it is waterproof. Ha, it's a good thing I didn't cut it. Like I said, it's real windy out here. Hang on, let me see. All right, now let's see if we can uh, purposely, I don't wanna go too deep in the water. Let's, let's bring it over here in some water that we can, that we can walk in, like this puddle right here. Okay, check that out. Wait a minute. There, now it's in the water. It's sitting in the water. Now we're going to take it out of the water. Going to shake it. I'm going to see what happens now. Okay, you know what? It seems waterproof, but, you know, I don't know if you should just soak it in the water like we just did. Let's try that again. Let's bring it over. Okay, put it in the water. Let's put it in some shallow water. Boom. Now, if I keep the motors running, it, it's okay. Okay, we got caught up on one of these. So let's put it over here. It's in shallow water. Now if it just sits in the water, you're, you're done. So I wouldn't advise leaving the motors running. But look at that, we're gonna drain the water out. Put it back on, obviously it's gonna work. So it's waterproof, but it's not a submarine or a boat. But let's skirt the water. Let's see what happens here. We're not going to shut the motor off. See, we leave the motors running. And it's waterproof. So, again, as long as you don't shut it off, you're good. See, I'm in the water. Okay. So it is waterproof, but it's not a boat. 
so glad I came down here. <laughs> it's kind of windy out here. It took me a minute to get adjusted. But you know what? This thing is still nice. I'm glad. I was excited. So again, it is waterproof, obviously, because my first time I crashed it just now, and it still worked. And that's something. All right, let's fly her around. Hi, how's it going? We had to buzz. Got to do that buzz. This thing's really fast, too, by the way. <laughs> mm, let's do another buzz. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, here we go. All right. You see that wind picking up, though, <laughs> fighting it. I think I'm in the first rate, too, by the way. I wanted to test that yaw. I'm going to do that when it's a little calmer. You've got to see that yaw rig. Maybe I'll do that when I get home or do it like in a night flight when it'll look real cool. But it's too windy to screw around out here because as you guys can see, I don't want to walk way out there. <laughs> Whoa. All right, let's bring her closer. This wind is getting stronger. I would say it's about eight mile an hour wind. Look, look how I'm fighting it. <laughs> it's fighting it. I'm fighting it. Come on in, baby. Come on. There we go. Yeah, it's real windy out here. I don't know why it's so windy here at the creek, though. All right. Let's try to get some, some semblance of control. <laughs> Whoa. So it, it is a good flyer. What you're seeing now is just me, pilot, fighting the wind, trying to get closer to home base at the base camp now there's the base camp <laughs> but I still whoa well we made a mistake I'll save that one for bloopers let's go back up now now that we're at the base camp whoa <laughs> So yeah, I guess the wind out here is another testament to how good this thing flies. Well, looks like we got an unexpected call. We have to save Wilson. Evan Wilson, we can't leave these motors running. Hurry. I will mention one thing. You won't be able to see it now, but I'm definitely going to do a knife flight on this thing. And uh, when, you, when you're running it, the bottom lights, they, it, on mine, they flash. But it's not an LVC warning, so I haven't seen that yet. The flashing on the lights appeared to me, well, obviously, I think they just actually died. But the lights on the bottom of this thing flash. Uh, I don't know if it's going to come up here, but I'll definitely do another video on that where the lights flash normally. And the uh, my guess is since the front one stays solid, that it's uh, probably your actual LVC because it's flashing right now. Okay? <laughs> you know what, guys? This has been a lot of fun. I'm glad I came out, shot this video. This is waterproof, but... You know, when you get it in the water, I wouldn't shut the motors off, though. You know, you shake it off, put it on dry ground, and it'll still fly. Okay. The JJRC H31. Thanks for watching.